Hello, and welcome back to Alice Mare. Now that I've officially blown my throat out doing the Cheshire Cat there. <coughs> Through the door we go. Teacher! Alan! Teacher! If you're here, then no, the cat can't be trusted. You really are proficient at breaking promises. It's quite troubling. That key, it looks sharp. Give that to teacher, would you? Right away. Now! Not a fucking chance, mate! Very well. This might hurt a little. I'm sorry. Ah, teacher, you bitch! Yeah, you take some of that! It doesn't even hurt. Now we can end this awful dream. Yes, it's the end. Will you hear my story? This isn't my first time in the world. I've been here before. Nightmare Syndrome. As an avid reader, I'm sure you've heard of it at least once. It's a disease that keeps one from waking and takes their soul. The cause is said to be unknown, but I believe it emerges in children who, whose hearts are in darkness. Have you noticed? I took in hurt children with nowhere to go, helped them, and let them live with me. But secretly I observed and studied them as children who might acquire the sickness. I must have upset you. I'm sorry. I want to destroy this world and these dreams, whatever it takes. I lost someone important to me right before my eyes in this world. Ever since then, I've thought of nothing else. It was my selfishness. So when you arrived, I was very surprised, maybe because you reminded me of myself from back then. If I made you unhappy, I th thought you'd acquire it, but I couldn't do that. Soon my door opened. I should have come alone. The rest of you were taken in as well, and the entrance grew bigger as a result. I've tried various things, but nothing worked. Alan, though you opened the door, you did nothing wrong. It's all my fault. This is my dream, my world. I hid too much of my weakness. Before I knew it, I was drowning in more than I could manage. So I have to end it, for her as well. I'm not very smart. She often told me so. I researched long, and I guess it was all for naught. Take this. I couldn't give you what you wanted most, because I was never given it. I don't even know what it's like. I'm sorry. If you have nothing, then you should make something. You have wonderful friends all around you. Just take it slow. You're smart, Alan, so you'll be fine. Right. I'm an adult, allegedly, so they won't eat me. I'll figure something out. There's a number for a man named Cliff on my desk. Say my name, he'll come help you. He's my one and only friend. He's very kind. He'll be fine. Wait, you haven't told me your name! Please forget about me. Then no one will have to come here again. Wait, I need your name! Good night, Alan. Oh, you son of a bitch. Why wasn't I exed? I thought I could X then, but I simply wasn't able to do it because I didn't know how to. What will I do now? I've lost everything. I have nothing. Oh, I'm so sleepy. Alright, teacher's desk it is. Cliff, isn't that the, uh, the guy who was in here earlier? Oh no. Teacher. Good night, teacher. What? What? No! Wait! Ah, uh, this isn't what I was supposed to do. Oh. Uh, I'm a moron. Everything's marked out. I'm pretty sure I was supposed to interact with the desk. I wasn't supposed to do this. Is 
Sorry, my throat's still recovering. I apologize. Damn it, I'm gonna have to skip through his conversation again. dreary day outside for me to be playing this game. I keep looking out my window and just seeing it pour down rain. I've been doing it for a few days now, actually. Hmm. Teacher! Do something with your hair. I mean, I guess that was technically an ending, but that was not the ending we were going for. Start clicking. Meow. Uh, hide the key behind my back. I guess I could have tried giving it to him this time. Oh well. I've heard your story. I like your story actually makes kind of sense. Except for everything being x x x x x Go! Find Cliff! x x x x Number for a man named Cliff. Finally time to use this phone. Yes, hello? It's not often you're the one calling me. That Alan I hear? Ah, I see. Get your things packed. I'd appreciate if you could do his too. I'll just be in a little bit. In the meantime, please. Right. It's okay. Just give me a little time. Bye. It's a boy from earlier and a girl who resembles him. It's no I'm in beverage, but not in rink. I'm in hurt, but not in pain. I'm in seven, not seen. I'm in drizzle, but not in ran. There's a control list there. Nice. Okay, what am I supposed to be doing? I didn't mean to click it again, I'm sorry.
There we go. Sorry. Okay. I'm gonna figure out what to do, and I'll be back. I'll see you next time.